The two main surgical options are a lumpectomy, just taking the tumor out and preserving the breast. The second is a mastectomy. Uh, with a lumpectomy, um, it all depends on uh, how th the tumor size is. Um, usually this, that is available for women with small, smaller tumors, uh, you know, less than five centimeters. Um, and um, with lumpectomy, the person does have to have radiation therapy treatments after their surgery. So those two are tied together. The radiation therapy treatments usually last for six weeks, Monday through Friday. Um, and that's rather intensive. So if someone wants to have a lumpectomy, they'll, they need to know that they are going to have to do the radiation therapy uh, treatments. The second option is a mastectomy. And mastectomy um, entails removing the entire breast. We always offer all our patients uh, who have mastectomy uh, immediate breast reconstruction of their candidates, meaning at the time of their surgery, when I perform the mastectomy, while they're still asleep in the operating room, the plastic surgeon comes in and does some sort of breast reconstruction, either with an implant or um, a tissue-based um, uh, reconstruction, using their own tummy tissue or other tissues um, to recreate a breast. So um, usually with mastectomy, the person would not need radiation therapy treatments. Um, so that's usually eliminated. It really depends on what the patient wants. A lot of it's pre uh, patient choice. I give my patients an option. I don't, I don't tell most people which one to choose. Some people, they have to do a mastectomy because their tumor is either too large or they have dis um, dis disease throughout their breasts. So for those people, we do steer them towards doing mastectomy. But most people who come um, with smaller cancers, it's their choice which one they want to pursue.